Fabulous and unmistakable Christmas display at Beau Rivage. Everybody loves it. Welcome back to the Four O'Clock Show. I'm here with uh, Teresa Malone, who is the horticulture manager with all the beautiful plants out front, and also a big part of this Christmas display. Teresa, how long have you all been doing this? How long have you been involved? Uh, I've been involved with the Christmas display for 23 years. I've been at the Bow for 24 years. And what do you enjoy about it? I mean, it just makes you, me feel good when I come in. It, uh, it brings so much happiness to people. The children love it. Uh, it just br brings a lot of happiness to everyone. It now, puts you in the spirit. Yeah, well, I, I'm in the spirit, I can tell you that much. Now, when do you start kind of putting everything together? January. I go to market in January and I start right away. Yeah, so this never ends then, never essentially. Never ends, it never ends. Yeah. And uh, has it evolved and changed much over the years? We keep adding every year. We add a little bit more to the decor. Uh, next year we have a few new things planned, so it would be interesting. But it's a constant work in progress. Yeah. And uh, what's kind of your favorite part of I, I love the Aww. toy soldiers. I love Santa. I love the, the Santa and the reindeer. And I love our 25-foot Christmas tree. It's very festive. What variety of reactions do you see from people, and maybe especially even when kids are in here staying on the property? Children love coming in here. You'll see them running around, and they get very, very excited waiting for Santa to come. It puts them definitely in the spirit. Yeah. And why do you think it's important? Because uh, Beau Rivage has really made a name for itself at this Christmas yes. display. It's a big part of, uh, of the Beau. Why do you think it's important to make this presentation every year? Well, I just think our guests love it. They, uh, several of them come here just to see the Christmas decor. They, uh, they love it. Um, it's, it, it is our signature piece. Any way of estimating how many lights or how many trees or how many anything there are? We have hundreds of Christmas tree. We use LED lights, so there's no telling how many lights are on here. Uh, thousands of poinsettias. Right now, there's probably about 2,300 poinsettias in here as of right now. We might want to contact Guinness. That might be a world record. <laughs> maybe, uh, maybe. And it's not only inside, but it's outside as well. Your horticulture department in your beautiful garden out on Highway 90, you're kind of switching over to sort of some winter plants? Yes, we're changing over to pansies right now, of course, with the uh, LSU Mardi Gras colors. So we'll be ready for Mardi Gras during that time. Um, and it's just taken us a couple of days to get the front garden ready, though. Now, did you say LSU, Marty? Are you an, a Tiger fan? Absolutely. Oh, so you had to sneak that in. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> okay, we'll go LSU. I'll, I'll ride along with that one. Well, Teresa, when does it all come down? We'll start taking it down around January 5th, 6th. It starts coming down, and that's a major process.